What up, what up? Squawny people, I am at a race. I'm Danny. I'm Danny. Danny, Danny, Danny. We're jumping back to a few honest trailers. I ain't gonna do all the ones that I skipped over the last few weeks. We're gonna do mm -hmm. Batman Begins because what the fuck can they say about that? Quite a bit. To be Quite honest. a bit. <laughs> so honest Quite junkies, bit. man. They'll nitpick anything. Let's get into it. It's like CW. Goes to the movies. Did you like Batman Begins? Yeah, I actually did. After Joel Schumacher made Batman silly. Never leave the cave without him. But before Zack Snyder made him a joke. Why did you say that name? Chris Nolan made a movie that got the Dark Knight just right. Where are you? Here. <laughs> Batman Begins. <laughs> See one of the best, yet oddly not that successful Batman films <laughs> that was so good, it allowed Christopher Nolan to do whatever he wanted afterwards. Except distance himself from the franchise. In this perfectly told superhero origin story. Back when we weren't sick of superhero origin stories. That realistically explains how a boy became a crime fighting bad ninja. Instead of a trust fund kid with a deep seated fear of wells. I mean, had to be even odds he'd become well man, right? <laughs> Experience a feature length attempt to ground Batman in reality, where the Batmobile was just a bridge building rocket car Wayne Tech had laying around. The Batcave was simply part of New York's Underground Railroad. Your great right, right, grandpa was involved in the Underground Railroad. And so. the bat shoes that summon a giant cloud of angry bats are um mm. total BS. But who cares? How cool is this? Follow along on every step of Bruce Wayne's heroic journey, from cosplaying as a hobo, to stealing food, to blowing up a school, and witness his brutal training at the hands of the Liam of Neeson's, I mean the League of Shadows, a group with a sinister plan to stop crime by using a microwave gun to vaporize their special fear juice to kick off the purge. Wait, what? I thought this was supposed so to be the weird. realistic one. That sounds like something Adam West would go up against. It's a sad pill. How the fuck did I want so much in that? I was just thinking that. With the League of Shadows on the wow. only criminals played in Gotham, there's also Batman, who, if you think about it, is a violent criminal who answers to no one, waging a one man war on the law itself. When not killing people, he killed a lot of people in that front, yeah. accidentally. I'm Batman. I love that, but the Batman feels that way. I'm not going to kill you. Stick with the Sorry, still counts as murder if you make a train do it. Joining <laughs> <laughs> this loner on his one man quest for justice are a lot of other people. Like Alfred, a butler so loyal, he'll drag Batman's sedated girlfriend into the back of a car, no questions asked. This is the worst for wear. <laughs> Lucius Fox, a man who might be helping Bruce to be a better serial killer for all he knows. If you want to tell me exactly what you're doing, when I'm asked, I don't have to lie. Jim Gordon, a cop with the morals, glasses, and mustache of Ned Flanders. <laughs> Rachel Dawes, a childhood twin with a mysterious past of drinking condensed milk. Alfred still keeps the condensed milk on the top shelf. And, holy s***, is that King Joffrey? That is him! Why are you giving him military no. hardware? <laughs> Take him out before it's too late! So strap in with a movie that saved Batman from puns and irrelevance. Let's kick some ice. With the right mix of gritty realism oh, and comic book theatricality that's, that's a perfectly right. focused, character-driven story. Except for the whole third act. If they get their machine into Wayne Station, it'll cause a chain reaction that'll vaporize the entire city's water supply. And the fact that half the dialogue is cute repetitions like of things someone said earlier. Yeah. It's a bit technical. The key thing is, is that my company's future is secure. It's not the one anymore. If I do, it defines what. Didn't you get the memo? Shut up! No wonder this movie's so good. They only had to write half a script. Starring Daryl Leet, Gotham Abbey, Roz Actually, Rachel Dawson's Creek. Serious oh. Blue, If I Only Played Bruce Wayne, Ken he wants did. to not be wasted in this oh, movie, serious. but he is, and... He would have been a good Bruce Wayne, but I think he'll be a good Batman. I think it ain't 
how Bruce Wayne got his groove back. Huh. Oh, the League of Shadows has been a check against. See, and I find these things starting to find these things in so exactly. Too much whitewashing. Loaded train ships with plague rats. From London to the ground. Cancel Firefly. Made Crash win Best Picture. <laughs> Discover Justin Bieber. <laughs> made her zombie a meme. It's time to embarrass the Dark Knight. Worse than Joel Schumacher did. Batman, you're a cunning strategist and a master of theatricality. <laughs> but I found your one hidden weakness. Getting the <laughs> beaten out of you. <laughs> the Screen Junkies wow. Roast of Batman. Watch now. Go away! I can't argue again. Wow. It was tough, but no, it, it was right. It was right. Brilliant move, though. Still, nothing, obviously. Nothing it. Makes me want to go back and revisit. It does contradict saying. itself, though. I won't kill people, but in him escaping the League of Assassins, I'm he burns you, that building down. Bruce Wayne is a schizophrenic who seriously doesn't realise he has a split personality that is the Joker and Batman. That's his like ideal picture of a Batman story. Like him and the Joker are the same person. They are. Mine is I wanna see it be Flashpoint Batman. Where it's the dad instead oh, of the yeah. son. That's the version Do I you know wanna that see. One, a lot of people didn't notice that the mum was the Joker. Yeah, but he doesn't have to she doesn't have to be. No, if they tell it without being a Joker. Notice, it was like, but are you serious? Come on. That would be beautiful, man. <laughs> You reckon the uh, Affleck? Bat Affleck is on point, I have to say. Probably the best Batman since. Um, I think he's a better Batman. Than and some people say this. As but Batman. I don't yeah. like. I like his Bruce Wayne, but I don't like. He's Batman. This, yeah, yeah his which name's is funny. This is the, the Christopher. I, Christ I couldn't forget. Christ I was talking about this just the other day. Christ Christ we're gonna get it. Chris <laughs> no, Christian Slater. No, 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 what was his name? Is it IMDB? Should we leave? Christopher! I'm gonna kick myself. Holy shit! I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I know, I know. I know. You can't cut this bit out. This is actually quite Wow! Funny. Batman Returns. Um, oh my god. Dude, oh, oh my lord, Jesus. Is this what mobile phones and. Technology is done to us like a brain of mush. Is it Christopher's surname or first name? Christian Bell. It's not even Christopher. Damn. Wow. I can't believe that. Wow. <laughs> Embarrassing. <laughs> Christian Bell. I like his Bruce Wayne, but I never liked his Batman. The voice, <clears throat> just the shitty <clears throat> action. <clears throat> FX Batman way better. <clears throat> but I think Bell's Bruce Wayne's better than Affleck's. So far, we haven't seen enough of Batman yet, really too much, but... Um, Affleck's Batman is mm. much better, like... Potentially, like, love. Like, yeah, like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you realise it's all fucking latex. No, but you do get proper big, though. Yeah. You see him training, you just... Yeah. You did get hench. But, bro, if you guys agree with this shit, let us know, write the comments below. Thumbs up, share, subscribe, Eddie, Danny. <laughs>